Hello again, Duck on the Clock with more Mega Man 4 Plus. I think this is going to be the last episode. Now that I'm all stocked up, I don't even need those. Ooh. Probably don't want to be running into these guys, though. Oh, fortunately they gave me some health. And I completely missed all that weapon energy. Fortunately, I don't really need too much, so it should be okay. And it's Ram. Well, we did see him teleporting away, along with the others. And yet, he still has not received any upgrades whatsoever. Okay, I have really no idea what to anticipate here, so... Um... I'm just gonna try and, uh... Try and fight these guys. Okay, here's Bright Man. God dang it. Please tell me that counted. It didn't count. I really feel like that should have counted. Okay, that counted. And I get some weapon energy refills too, so I mean that's good. More or less. I don't know what his timing is gonna be, so. Okay, that was all right. I'll be full up on dive missile too. Okay, and Feral Man. It's not completely stopped, but is slowed down. Uh, that actually makes it a little bit more of a fair fight, I suppose. Oh, I can actually charge. That might have made the battle go a little bit faster, but eh, I'll take it anyway. This one should be Ring Man. Kind of want to get him out of the way a little bit earlier, but. Oh boy. 
I'm not fond of that version of Ring Man. Total honesty there. Okay. That should be Skull Man, that should be Dust Man. I forget which of these is Toad Man. This one is. Okay, yeah, I've remembered Toad Man being a little bit harder than he normally is. But, uh, I figured it was worth a shot. Good enough. Okay. Dive Man was a pain. But that was before I used Skull Barrier. All right, this should be Skull Man. <laughs> Who has decided not to put up a shield at all, and I am thankful for that. And lastly, we should have Captain Justman. Yeah. Oh, man, I'm doing so badly. Still want Ring Boomerang out, because Ring Boomerang is what is this guy is weak to. So does he still have a uh, safe spot? I don't think so. It certainly doesn't look like it. <laughs> well, I was going to test it out. <laughs> Two lives left. Hopefully that won't be relevant. Okay. Just in front appears to be fine. Yeah, there is a safe spot. I'm not sure it's in the exact same spot, but it's still close enough. Okay, I was not actually holding the button there. Come on. These are only going one direction. Which actually makes them a little bit more annoying than normal. Okay, I don't actually want to explode these early, though. And I'm frozen, so I can't do the... Uh, Rain flush trick. 
Too bad, Wily gets to escape this time. So now we see if there's any more tricks that this guy is going to throw at us. Oh, I guess like, we get next life. I approve of that. Oh, you're back! Screw you, Blade. Hey, guess what? We got uh, another trick thrown at us. That went super well. Start off on this side this time. Ah. Tells, give your bosses them. Oh, his ha his pinch mode is the worst. I'm dead. I'm dead. Don't even bother. Okay, I super do not like Belay in this game. Why'd you stop so short? Ah! Also, I thought I was full up on E-Tanks. How, how am I not? Okay. Well... That was not much fun. No lives. But the uh, hitbox is a little bit more generous on this. And was that all? Is that all? I'm not sure I want to make assumptions. This game has kind of ambushed me before. Thankfully, that wasn't super difficult because he uh, 
his uh, Wiley's hitbox lingered a lot more. But it looks like we're done. Phew, that was a, uh, a game for sure. Mega Man 4 Plus. That definitely was put the plus in the Mega Man 4. The uh, stages were reminiscent of the original, although not exact replicas, but then there was the uh, little additional section that made you have to fight the bosses again to get the upgraded weapons. Some of which were... I don't know what the upgrade even was. Um, the special weapons, though, were generally better, or at least the same, except for Dust, dust Crusher taking so much more ammo, but uh, Dive Missile was a lot better. Um, Skull Barrier was better. Uh, and they were pretty fun to play around with, when I felt like I could afford it anyway. It's hard to play around too much with special weapons when you don't know what you're going to need in the coming uh, stage, but on the other hand, I kind of knew in a fair to a fair degree what all the weaknesses were because they were the same as the original game. Um, bosses were a little bit on the rough side. A lot of patterns that used to work don't really work as much anymore or at all dive man dive man's ring man's they're two bosses who are actually generally pretty easy in the original game but the what makes them easy was not present here um toad man also bright man going dark yeah, that's, uh, that's no fun. Um, and, I mean, some bosses that weren't, that weren't super hard, because Bright Man wasn't really easy in the original. I mean, he was more exploitable, but less predictable. Uh, Skull Man, I would never call easy, because I always have a difficult time against him. And in this game, it was just, like, Nasty, nasty, nasty. Um, and then... And then there was Blade. Who wasn't in the original, uh, the original Mega Man 4 NES, was in the Game Boy version, was a little bit easier in the Game Boy version. Uh, because he was a little bit less... haphazard. Uh, here... <laughs> also, he didn't heal in the Game Boy version. Oh, self-repair. That is just the worst. Ram was an annoying little bastard. Like, he shouldn't be that hard. He took plenty of damage from the buster, but... <sighs> Again, it's... There's no tells. Bosses either move in patterns, they have tells. <laughs> if they don't do either, then it's kind of um, <laughs> a pain to try and figure out what they're going to do. I, but overall, the game was good. I liked the game a lot. Um, and... Yeah, by Micker. I don't think I said his name very much in the last bunch of episodes, but that's who made it. So yeah, I had fun. I encourage you guys to try it out, uh, especially if you like Mega Man 4, because this is just more Mega Man 4, really. Mega Man 4 Deluxe Edition. Anyway, that's all for me for now. Until next time, this is Doc. I'll see you later.